Welcome back inside the studio. Paul Burmeister, Tim Howard, Danny Higginbotham. What a second half for West Ham. They find a way to win 2-1. to one. Uh, Tim, I'm, here's what I'm wondering. This 2-1 this win for West Ham, and thinking mainly about the second half, mm -hmm. more about what the Hammers did or about what Spurs did mm -hmm. not do? Well, you got to give huge, huge credit to West Ham. That being said, um, and I asked the question at halftime, and I think this is going to start creeping in. You know, when you look at Spurs, three straight home losses, they haven't done that since 2008. The Ange Postacoglu, who I do, I, I love, most people love, the, the way he plays this Ange ball. But ultimately, you, he's going to have to answer questions about some of the defending, because here's how it works. The best teams who want to win titles, right, Liverpool, City, Arsenal, there are times that are very clear where they have to say, we have to defend with numbers, we have to sit back, and it might not be pretty, but guess what? We're going to be champions and we're going to do it. I'm not suggesting they're going to get relegated, but Leeds did that the last couple of years. They just couldn't defend. They, they tried to be expansive, always playing on the front foot, foot, leaving slots defensively, and they could not defend, and they paid the price for it. In this league, you will. So I know they like to defend with the ball. There's going to be moments you have to defend stoutly. Yeah, Spurs have not been able to manage the lead. Why? What you've just said, managing. And you have, to, you have to, as a player, be able to manage the game. As a neutral, it's great to watch because you know they're always going to be entertaining. But as a fan, at times, you, you want to see a team that's going to go, like Tim's just said, when things start to go against you, and you can feel it in the game as a player, when you are on that pitch, you feel the tide starting to turn against you. And when you do, you go, OK, let's hold back a little bit, maybe more in a 4-5-1, see this out, and then we'll go again. But they didn't do that. So from, from my side of things, looking at this team, it's yes, they'll score goals, yes, they'll create opportunities, yes, they'll be fun to watch but you have to manage the game better. As Tim said, that's what the top teams do. And, and, and what Danny's saying is it's not about changing tactics and going away from your philosophy, because that's what uh, Postacoglu is saying. We're going to play one way and we're going to play one way all the time. What Danny's talking about is there's, there's going to be 10 minutes in a 90-minute game where it just it's ugly, you run out of shape, just say, listen, everyone get back into shape, we're going to defend this for... 10, 20 minutes. It's not changing tactics. It's not changing philosophy. It's just simply managing the game. Yeah, and it's making sure you don't give the initiative to the opposition. So you look at West Ham, what they did. West Ham came out in the second half. David Moyes, I'm sure, at halftime would have said to him, listen, don't be afraid. Play 10, 15 yards higher at the pitch. So they did that. Tottenham didn't react to that. So all of a sudden, you've got Bowen, you've got Ward-Prowse, you've got Suchek. They're all getting closer together up the pitch. And Tottenham at no point have said, OK, we'll drop off, we'll just deal with this, this then we'll go again. West Ham adjusted, Spurs didn't. What's the best thing you can say about West Ham? And what uh, they just just the, their ability to stay together and see the game out, and they got the goals when it counted. Hi there, I'm Rebecca Lowe, studio host for NBC's coverage of the Premier League. Don't forget to hit subscribe to watch more videos all season long. And for even more Premier League content, from original series to live matches, head over to Peacock. And be sure to tune in for Premier League mornings every weekend on USA Network and on Peacock. We will see you there.